Hi guys. Um, I'm making a video on what's in my makeup bag. Okay, so first of all, this is my makeup bag. I love it. It's Michael Kors. If you can't see that. And I love this makeup bag. And it's the perfect size. And it's so cute. Okay. So the first thing I have is my bronzer. And it is Physicians Formula, which is the company. And it's, um... It's the Pearls of Perfection. That's what it's called. Um, and it's actually really cool. It has a little sponge in it, like to the applicator basically. And then if you look on the inside, I don't want to spill them, but you can see all the little pearls. And they're all like different shades of bronzer. And you rub it, and then it comes off like that. And then you put it on your face. And I really, really love this product. A lot of bronzers have like a shimmer in them, or, like glitter, and it, you can like tell that you're wearing it. But this one, um, it doesn't and it's really really good and um, it matches my skin really well so that's always good. the next thing I have are these two covergirl um, formulas and they are um, liquid powder makeup basically and I have one in ultimate they're both the ultimate finish and um, I have one in buff beige and one in classic ivory and um, I'm almost out of this one and it's kind of broken so I'll show you I'll show you this one. Okay, it looks like this. It just says a mirror, and then the um, the actual makeup, and then the little sponge applicator. And um, this isn't my favorite product, but it gets it gets the job done basically. Um, it it doesn't really go on that smooth, so I wouldn't really recommend it, um, especially if you have dry skin, because over the summer when my skin gets a little dry. Um, you can tell with when that makeup's on, so that's not always the best. The next thing I have is the Maybelline New York Cover Stick. And it is in medium beige. And um, it's basically a concealer. And I mostly use it for under my eyes because under my eyes get really dark. And um, I also use it in like the corners of my eyes right there. And... Um, I love this product. I'm really happy with what it, um this is actually the first time I got this. My um sister recommended it to me. My 14-year-old sister. And um it goes on really clear and um you can't tell. There isn't like a huge patch where you can tell that you're wearing it, so that's always good. The next thing that I have is the Great Lash um clear transparent mascara from Maybelline New York. And it looks like this. And um, this is what you basically put on your eyelashes before mascara. And um, you can also use it on your eyebrows. And it basically just separates the hairs. So um, when you use it on your eyelashes, it separates your eyelashes. So um, your mascara doesn't clump as much. And um, the actual applicator brush is really good. I really like it. It's... Um, the bristles are really spread out, so it actually really does separate your eyelashes, which is really good. And the mascara I use, which I'm going to switch because I don't really like it that much, but I use the um, CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion in brown black. Um, I like the I used to like it, but after a while, like the applicator brush is really thick. I don't know. I don't really like it that much, so I'm going to switch to a Maybelline New York product, probably. The next product I have are my eyeliners, and um, depending on the day I use different eyeliners, um, I have the CoverGirl Exact Eyeliner, which is um, goes with my brown eyes. It's like four brown eyes, and um, it's a good eyeliner. It goes on kind of chunky, I guess, but um, and then I also have CoverGirl's Line Exact Eyeliner which is kind of like a brush it's like it looks like um it's like a pen kind of I really like that one it doesn't dry very fast though and then I also have Wet n Wild's um, Idle Eyes Cream Shadow Pencil in a uh, navyish blue I really like this product but um I don't always like wearing blue eyeshadow blue eyeliner so I don't always use that. The next thing I have is the Maybelline New York Dream Bouncy Blush and I have it in Orchard Hush and um, 
I don't really wear blush except for this one, but I really like it. Um, it goes on really smooth and um, I don't, it's not like really bright and it goes well with my skin tone. Next is my eyeshadows. Um, I just have this Beauty Rush Victoria's Secret eyeshadow um, in Plum Passion. I don't really like it. It has a really weird applicator. If you look at it. I don't like it. But um, I use a brush and I just use the actual eyeshadow. Because the color is really nice. It's like a really dark brown. And then I have two color tattoos by Maybelline New York. I have it in Bad to the Bronze and Pomegranate Punk. I really like these colors. They're really nice. They're both um more neutral colors. But um the pomegranate plum one, punk one, um is like a more reddish and the other one is more of a brownish. Um next is my lips. I have this. I live by this product. It's Carmex. It's just chapstick. It's usually for like cold sores and stuff. But you use it for chapped lips and it works so well. And then I have um, a chapstick by EOS and it's this ball chapstick. I had it on my shopping hauls because I just recently got a new one. Um, and this one is um, strawberry sorbet. It smells so good and it works so well and I love it. And then I have a Beauty Rush lip gloss from Victoria's Secret. Um, it doesn't say the kind it is, but, uh, it's just a lip gloss. You know, Victoria's Secret carries, like, the entire line of lip gloss and stuff. And then the last two things are my baby lips. Um, I have the, um, the quench one and the fruit one. And I love them, and they're so good, and I'm currently looking for a cherry one, and I love how the pink one adds a tint to your lips, and it looks so good. And then I just have a simple brush in here. I don't keep my brushes in my makeup bag, except for this one. It's like a big brush. I don't know. It's just good to, for using like um, the bronzer and stuff. And <clears throat> that is it. That's all I keep in my makeup bag, and I hope you like this video. Please comment, subscribe, anything down below. And yeah, thanks for watching.